Alrighty, what's going on everybody? My name's Daniel M47, back at it again with another let's alright, I'm sorry, I'm not gonna do that. <laughs> but we are back for episode two. Obviously still recording this in one session because it literally the game came out an hour and eleven minutes ago. So we in last video got to the island, finally named the island and yeah so we are officially the resident uh what was it resident representative of the island of Kauai, i believe but yeah so literally right where we left off from last time so if i'm gonna be honest with you i don't know exactly what we're supposed to be doing right now are we supposed to be, are we supposed to be shaking penis trees and picking up cherries or are we supposed to be I don't know okay picking up flowers forgot you could do that I'm not gonna lie and can't do anything with these oh wait nope take it back me again <laughs> uh, but yeah guys this this game is gorgeous like like I was going back and I was watching some uh GameCube footage from obviously the GameCube version of the first Animal Crossing uh, which was I mean everyone just refers to it as Animal Crossing but it was I think uh, actually called Animal Crossing uh, population growing or something like that but um, oh my god I did not realize how like I mean, obviously, the times have changed, like, the graphics. Good lord. I mean, I never even thought about it, honestly, when I was playing it, but... Good lord, like, just seeing this is... <laughs> I don't even know. And the music, oh, it's just, like... This game itself, I mean, obviously, it, it it's not for everybody. And it's obviously not an action game. But it is, it's just something to play to relax very wholesome and just just a very different game than you would usually play there's no action or anything in this so if that's what you're looking for obviously this is not going to be the game for you but i don't know i don't know something about animal crossing has always been i don't know <laughs> either way we'll figure it out Alright, so maybe we just gotta talk to Tom Nook, question mark? Ah, Daniel, having a good time, yes? I know this is all a bit much, so if you feel like taking a short nap in your tent, by all means, go ahead. We'll keep the fire burning. Um, no, I'm not tired yet. Of course, you work hard and you play hard. Hmm, by all means, carry on. Just stop by and see me for a quick chat before you turn in. I have something to give you. Um, okay. Alright, what's up, Sylvia? We all just met, but chilling by the fire like this makes me feel like we've been best buds for ages. Boing! <laughs> Sitting around the campfire with cups of cherry juice, it almost feels like we're family. You can call me bro. <laughs> Alright, cool. Already got our first bro on the island. <laughs> We got a bro, a single mom? Cool, bro. We already got our wingman. Alright, I'm sorry. <laughs> uh, Alright, anyways. Alright, uh. Yes. Alright, um. Sure, I mean, I'm guessing that'll trigger the next thing. You probably want this. Oh, we get some furniture? Oh, a camping car. Okay. A few packages waiting in your tent as well. Okay, to open packages, use the things inside. Press A. And when you're ready, you can move. Obviously, okay, yeah. We've got another big day ahead of us tomorrow, so rest up as much as you can tonight. Yes, yes, that's all for me for now. Sweet dreams. Okay. Down to our beach tent. Let's go. Yeah. Well, 
let's see how small this place is. Oh, good God. <laughs> Holy crap. That is really small. All right. And that's a radio. And that is our lamp. Oh, wow. We got a lamp. Can we turn it on the radio? I wonder. The radio is on. Turn off. Leave on. No, we'll leave it on. Let's listen to some ASMR. Oh, no. I was just playing the music. Okay. I thought it was going to play us some, uh, some animal ASMR. <laughs> if you catch my <laughs> Alright, anyways, this is camping cot. So I guess maybe it's not caught up to us time-wise. Rest my head for a little while. Rest. Oh, wait, I think in this game you actually do have to sleep. Because if I... Or in the first game, I think if you didn't sleep, like, your eyes would actually get heavy and you would have, like, bags and stuff and you'd look freaking weird. I'm pretty sure that was the thing. <gasps> He's back! KK! So, it looks like you've decided to make your own way in the world. Get out there, explore new frontiers. It's all the way right, Daddy O. You don't need to live by anyone's rules but your own. The world was made for exploring, you know? Living free, being out there, it's a great feeling. Yeah, but take it from a cat who's been on the road. Being by your lonesome can grind on the soul. You've got to make friends along the way. Rambling this crazy world is Squaresville without some pals. Yeah, man, friends are where it's at. Speaking of rambling, I'm doing a bit of that myself. My bad. <laughs> Maybe it's about time for you to wake up to your new life. Oh, but listen up. That rap I just gave you about friends, it's pretty key. You'll dig this island life a whole lot more if you share it with some friends, if that's your scene. Yeah, an island paradise with your best pal sounds pretty groovy to me. Cool, when you wake up, you'll be in sync with real time. Oh, okay, yeah, so I was right. Oh, wait, I think if you sleep, you actually save. I think that's how you save the game. Oh, wait, I forgot. Dig something, whatever. It's probably just saying you dig it. You feel me? Animalies. Tom, look. Daniel! Are you in there? Oh, I hope I haven't woken you abruptly. I mean, maybe. Ah, but I do wish to discuss something with you. Yes, yes. I'll be here when you're ready. Okay. Wait, if it's synced up with real time, no way it's gonna be in the morning. Well, it'll be in the morning, but it'll still be dark. Ah, there you are. I hope you had a pleasant nap. Or, well, I suppose it was a bit more than a nap, wasn't it? It's a brand new day. Oh, good lord. I literally slept for like 24 hours. <laughs> I slept that long? Oh, 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 yes, it's quite normal to be worn out from such a long trip. And a marriage or life a bit. Speaking of which, I have a few more things that you might find useful as you adjust to life in our little paradise. First, you'll need one of these, yes? Oh, nope, there's the phone. It's your very own phone. I had these made especially for island residents. Wait, how do we have signal on this island? Just deserted island. Ah, I want to make sure it's working, right? Oh, jeez. <laughs> so you could try turning it on for me, hmm? Sure. Welcome. Nope, we got six apps. Nice. Good, good. It looks like you're getting good reception as well. How? They're in the trees. The trees. They're not real. It's the government. Okay, feel free to put it away for now. Yeah, okay. Say, Daniel, have you ever used a smartphone before? Uh, possibly. Uh, yeah, sure have. 
Very good, and this should be a breeze for you. In fact, these lip balms are rather easy to operate than ordinary balms. Oh yes, we simply remove most of the features. Oh gee. <laughs> Alright, one more thing for you. Okay. Oh, nice. It's your itemized bill. Wait, what? So this includes everything. Airfare, accommodations, labor tax, and of course your nook Oh, no. See, this is exactly what I'm talking about. He's a flippin' swindler, fam. He's a swindler. I thought this thing was completely paid for. Alright. Rigging your grant. Oh, no, here it is. Oh, my god. 49,000 bells. <sighs> what do you mean, okay? Well then, wait, you don't have any bill- Oh, yep, here it is. <laughs> I can't believe I didn't think of this. Ah, oh, of course. Well, no need to worry. I was prepared for exactly this type of tricky situation. Yes, I'm sure you were. It'll just make you work it off with some freaking tax on it. <laughs> Get away package, you can pay your fees with miles instead of the standard bills. Oh, this has got to be like that new achievement system I heard about. Call this extremely helpful service, the Nook Mileage Program. Uh, Nook Mileage? It's quite extraordinary if I do say so myself. With the Nook Mileage Program, you can earn miles by simply living your life here on Kauai. I dare say the more you enjoy your island life, the more Nook Miles you can earn. And you can use them to pay back your move-in fees and much more. Mm-hmm, I'm sure I can. So, the bottom line is, you don't need 49,800 bells to pay your move-in fees. But with this new service, would you believe it? It only comes to 5,000 miles. Yes, but what all does 5,000 miles entail is the real question. I'll just go ahead and register you so you can pay in miles. Yes, yes, but there are more details available within your Nook phone. Just open the Nook Miles app, and you'll see that you've earned some miles just for traveling to the island and joining the program. Okay, now if you'll excuse me, I must get back to a few other matters. But let me... Heart... Okay... Alright... So... Oh yeah, do a dance! Because we owe people money. Nice job. <laughs> I, oh yes, I can do whatever I want! You know, now that we owe $50,000... <laughs> From now on, island time will match the flow and time in the real world. Nice. Do not touch the power button when the auto save indicator on the top. Did it have auto save? I thought you used to have to save it. Maybe it was like sleeping or oh no, I think you had to talk to your gyroid outside of your house. You can also save and quit your game after pressing the mine. Oh, okay. Nice. Oh look, we've got. Wow, that looks very. Uh... Technical Nintendo. Oh, I've got some gifts. Thank you for downloading the update. We'd like to give you a present to show our appreciation. Please keep an eye out for the future updates as well. Okay. All right. Nice. We got a present. Congratulations on your big move. We hope you enjoy the new island life. To celebrate this fresh start, we'd like to give you a gift that's sure to come in handy. Nice. All right. Um. You know what? We'll keep it. The update one's pretty dumb, though. So, yeah, we'll get rid of that. Alright. Let's see what we got. I got... Oh, a Nintendo Switch. Nice. If only they would give me a legitimate Nintendo Switch. Alright, what's in this one? What's in the canister? Oh, simple DIY workbench. What does that mean? Learn? This is a DIY recipe. I wonder how I can memorize it. Uh. Okay. Oh, those things that got really were just weak. That's nice. Alright, well... Let's... Put our switch in our tent, I guess. Yeah, let's just put it right here, I guess. 
Nice. <laughs> you can turn it on and everything. Man, I remember there was a mini game in the uh, GameCube version where you could literally play like Donkey Kong and like two other games, I think. Or maybe it was just Donkey Kong, I don't know. But you could actually play them in Animal Crossing. It was pretty cool. Music is interesting. I'm not really sure I, I'm like digging it, but it's whatever. <laughs> Alrighty. Wait, so was this is the phone? Oh, oh, camera. Take pictures using various filters and effects. Oh, you got filters? What? The pictures will be saved to the album on the home menu, and other users who use the same system will be able to see them. Okay. So what? The f oh wow, you can actually change the wow. That's that's interesting. Okay, so what is this? Oh, you can add frames. Cinema frame. Nice. Okay. And then Y zoom out, X is zoom in. So wait, what does the right bumper do? Oh, you turn. Hello. Oh, and then zoom in and out. Well, no, up and down. Okay. That's interesting. <laughs> That's interesting. Alright. Well, anyways. So wait, am I supposed to do anything else on the phone? Nook Mile. Oh right, the Nook Miles thing. You're enrolled in the Nook Mileage program. Earn Nook Miles for completing island activities. Then trade those miles for various perks and goods at the Nook Shop in the Resident Service Center. Make the most out of island life. Earn Nook Miles. Okay. Oh wait, I got some already. You traveled a long way. Yeah, that's just a traveling thing. Oh hey, I got 500. So wait, there's 5,000. I literally just need 10 of these things. Dude, that's not bad at all. That is correct math, right? Yeah, it is. Nice. You tr yeah. Okay. Okay, so we need to fish. Catch the f bugs like usual. <sighs> Need to stop yawning. And okay, okay. And just chat with the residents. All right, that's that's not bad. That this should be pretty easy. All right. So maybe you can pay off your house pretty easily. The custom designs with this app, you can create custom designs for clothing and stuff. Okay, cool. It's a chance that your custom designs will be seen by their player. Okay, yeah, whatever. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, probably flag. Yeah, okay. Alright. Well, uh, nice. Ah, alrighty. So, yeah, so I don't understand what this DIY workbench thing is, but. As far as like other stuff on our phone, a rescue service, I don't even know what that is. Passport, map, okay, map, we can literally see by just standing still. Passport, oh, passport information, okay. Yeah, 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 okay. I mean, that's pretty basic, I guess. I mean, edit, what would you, comment? Oh, you can change the comment? Um. Okay. Uh, you know what? We'll figure out what to do with that later. What is rescue service? Use the surgeon. Uh, okay, when your path is blocked or you're stuck. How does that work? Oh, wait, what? No, no, no. I thought it, it just said you gotta use Nook Miles to do that. Heck no. Heck no. Wait, is this like his store, I'm assuming, or his house? Oh, he just lives in his store anyways, why would he? 
Ah, Daniel, welcome, welcome. As you can see, it's quite cozy in here. It's funny how cozy doesn't always mean comfortable. <laughs> yeah, it makes sense. Let me know if you need advice on how to spend your time on this island, or anything else. If you need some advice about basic island materials, you should talk to Timmy. He can help you... Okay... Uh, okay, so the, he's the guy that we sell stuff to now, that's nice. Not strictly advisable from a business perspective, but quite generous, yes, yes. Oh, one more important thing. I'm offering a free DIY workshop that can help you really build it. Okay, so that's that thing we were talking about earlier. That's okay. So what does it do? Is this the DIY workshop? Ah, I see. Oh, yes. DIY workbench, okay. Yes, yes, DIY workshop. Each participant will make and keep their own tools and receive a set of DIY wires. Okay. will be quite useful for your island life, hmm? So, shall I put you down for the next available session? Wait, what do you mean? Confused. Is this the crafting system, I'm assuming? Is this like a workbench? Crafting bench? Crafting table? <laughs> well, of course, DIY shirt. <laughs> I know it. Okay, okay, I guess I did technically ask. It's a way for you to create your own goods, like furniture. Okay, so yeah, it is. Uh, what do you mean giving away for free if I'm building it? Okay. Okay, so yeah, I just need to do the next available what do you mean the next available thing there's like no one here on the island but okay oh yeah of course yeah, it happens to be free this very moment alright come to my DIY workshop oh I suppose a workshop is overstating it you see how simple it is to DIY or do it yourself you'll understand what I mean the basic idea is to gather materials, follow a recipe, and then craft the workbench. Okay. So today we'll be constructing a fishing rod using common materials that you can find anywhere. For this particular recipe, we require a mere five tree branches. It is admittedly a... Okay. Alright. Now then, come see me once you've collected the materials, hmm? Okay. <laughs> a little... Music. Did we already have some? Oh, we had two. Yeah, we're just gonna grab a decent amount of these guys. Shake the trees, shake the trees. Give me freaking tree branches. Oh, get it. Come on, give me your branches. <laughs> You suck! I just need branches! Oh, hey, there we go. Oh, that's not what I wanted, but alright. Give me the tree branches! What the heck? Oh, hey, look, I found a hundred dollars. And I keep picking up grass instead of the tree branch, that's nice. Give me a tree branch! Nice. He did say seven, right? I'm pretty sure he said seven. Alright. Gonna get a little- I gotta get used to the map again, because it's really weird how this is laid out. Like, it's, it's interesting and cool, like, but I haven't played the game like this in forever. Okay, so... Ah, uh, dang, I found the necessary materials. Hmm? Oh, then let's get started on crafting that fishing rod. To begin, we'll just select a project from the workbench and get started. Go ahead, give it a try. Okay. Oh, so I did only need five, okay. Nice! I made a flimsy fishing... flimsy fishing rod, that's nice. Crafting is quite simple, provided you have the correct recipes. And that concludes my free DIY workshop. Oh, there's just one last thing. I have a few common DIY recipes for you, free of charge, naturally. I just need to send them to your Nook phone. Would you mind opening it up? Uh, sure. 
Nice. I got a new app. Splendid. The DIY app is now installed on your phone and ready for you to use anytime. And the floaty fishing rod you just crafted is yours to keep. It may not last forever, but it should serve you well for a little while at least. Yeah, so I heard now everything can break instead of just your axe. That's nice. Speaking of fishing, I'm a master angler, but perhaps I can give you a few tips. In my experience, you should aim in front of the shadow of a fish when you cast your... Oh yeah, I'm going to see anything you manage to catch. I'm quite curious about the local fauna. So, there used to be a... Uh... Museum. And like just a bunch of other stuff, like town hall. I, I, I'm assuming you just get all of that over time. And I know there is a museum in this one because I've, I've heard like a lot of people talking about it. And obviously that's what that giant aquarium had to be at the beginning of the game, the, like the cutscene. Okay, so okay. All right, let's try and catch this big whopper. Hello, fishy fishy. Come and get it. Oh, sorry, I gotta click it again. Sorry. Oh, nice. A C bass. No, wait. It's at least a C plus. Ah. The jokes. The jokes for days. <laughs> okay. Oh wait, so I wonder if I got anything on the nook phone for that, like the miles. Oh wait, yeah, because that was, there was one, right? Uh, angling for perfection. Oh, okay, so yeah, I got one, now I gotta get ten. Oh jeez, am I actually gonna have to fish for ten of these guys? I doubt it. Let's go talk to him again after we caught a fish. It'd be pretty boring for you guys if I was just gonna sit here and catch ten fish in a row. Oh, oh, oh wait. Oh yeah, I gotta get a little closer than that. Oh, don't be on him. Okay, cool. Come on. You know you want it. Let's go. Hey, another sea bass. Oh no, this is a black bass. The most metal of all fish. Yeah, hardcore. <laughs> all right. All right. So, uh, can I craft more stuff? Or yes, let's craft something. Oh, hey, I can make a campfire and a flimsy net. Nice. Oh, I need some more of those and some of those. Okay, so I need one more for those and three more for those. Okay, so let's just grab eight so we can make both of them since we'll already be out there anyways. I mean, it'd be nice to have a campfire like right outside my house. Oh, there was a bird. I don't know why he's awake this late at night, but all right. All right. So that gives us five, six, seven, eight. Nice. Well, that was easy. I mean, we got more, but that's all good. Just looking for some fishy fish. Doesn't look like there was anything over there. All right. Let's go make us some stuffs. Ha ha ha! Yes, it's me. I'm back. Back again. Alright, so let's craft us a fishing... Wait, no. Not the fishing rod. I already have that. A flimsy net. I've made a flimsy net. Alright, let's keep crafting. Let's make this... Wait, can you do other stuff? No, that's it. Okay, alright. 
GG, nice job, you know, definitely got a nail in those sticks together so we can carry the entire, <laughs> you can carry it with us, okay, <laughs> no, I'm good for now, alright, so I don't remember there being this much, like, hand-holding in the original, I mean, it's not really, like, hand-holding per se, because, I mean, it didn't tell me I had to build those things, but... Maybe there was this much. I don't really know. Like I said, it's been a long... It's been a long time. Alright, so let's... Hey, 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 how do I... Oh, I need a shovel for those, I think. Um, okay. So... This has got to be... How do I light it? Oh, oh, there it is. Nice. Alright. And let's try and catch us up, because I don't think I can... Come on, peek out. Oh. Peek out again. I'm pretty sure you gotta have a shovel, but... Eh. Come on. Eh. Yeah, that's a no-go. <laughs> need to find a bug. I love how we saw like so many but oh wait no there's a fish though. Fishy Oh wow that was really far. Thought. That was pretty bad as well. Come on. Come on keep look just look straight up. There you go. Come on fishy fishy. I can't see my big old head. Oh no, he got away! Damn, my fat head. Alright, come on. Where's a, a bug of some type? Oh, oh, there's one. Don't fly away, bug. Hang in there. Huzzah! Yes! I caught a moth! And I had a ball de- Ah. Uh. <laughs> no. <laughs> oh, jeez. Alright, well. I died a little inside with that one, but it's cool. It's whatever. Alright. Uh, well, you know what? We'll catch one more. Oh, no, that had, that was an owl. Okay. It's pretty weird, because I've seen an owl in the game before. It's like a person, but... Act. Yeah, <laughs> I don't know why I keep trying to do that. Yeah, I think that was- oh, 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 wait. Huzzah. Oh, hey, hey, come on. I got him. I got a moth! Alright, well, no, I've just got two moths, that's great. Alright, so do I have, like, any more crafting things I can do, maybe? Question mark? Oh, hey, look, he's reading a book. Ah, Daniel, hello, hello. What would you like to talk to me about? I'm all ears. Uh, I found creatures. Ah, splendid. Let's have a look, shall we? Yes, I've got two wasps. Or moths, sorry. <laughs> wasps. Oh, what a catch. I do believe this is a moth. Hmm, if this island can support a moth. Why, who knows what other fantastic creatures we might find living here? Daniel, I have an idea. An old friend of mine runs a museum. Oh, see, the museum. Nice. And I'd love to send it to him for a closer look. Would you be okay with that? Uh, sure. Let's get a museum up in here. Thank you. I promise that I'll take extra good care of your moth. <laughs> oh, that reminds me. This is in no way tied to your generous donation just now, but I have a useful app to show you. Okay. Oh, oh. What is that? Oh, Critterpedia? I see, it is a Critterpedia app. It's a terrific resource for an inspiring island researcher such as yourself. With this one app, you'll be able to get all the important details about the bugs and fish you catch. Yes, yes. I do hope you'll continue to fill it up with your discoveries and share them with me too. Nice, we got a Pokédex!
<laughs> I'm sure I'll be able to come up with some kind of additional reward. <laughs> okay. So, what would you like to talk about? Okay, let's see. Let's see, what should I do? Yes, yes, that is the question. What is this island is a diverse habitat for many interesting creatures, you know, other than us. Yes, yes, you can catch all kinds of insects and fish if you practice with your net and fishing rod. I'd be most curious to see any creature that you do catch, hmm? By all means, bring them to me. Okay. Um, so can we sell these guys? Don't waste any time. We're still setting up both for stars as well and small selection of goods for... Oh, okay. Okay, so, oh, no, Timmy's the one that sells stuff. What is that? Inflatable sofa? Outdoor generator? Yeah, how about neither of those? Nice. Okay, so this little guy is the one that we sell stuff to, right? Well, Daniel, it's great to see you. That campfire was a lot of fun. We're here all night, so feel free to stop by if you need to talk about anything I like. Also, I'll be out and about during the day checking up on everyone. If you're ever unsure about what you should do, don't hesitate to stop in for a chat. What? I thought I was supposed to sell stuff. Alright. Is this an ATM? Oh, how could I forget? I should give you a quick explanation about- Oh, terminal, okay. That is our next stop. It's a terminal for services that will further enhance your island life. At the moment, you can use two services. First is Nook Shopping. It's a catalog shopping service for items that can be hard to find on the island. Second, this terminal serves as an automatic bell dispenser, or ABD, for the Bank of no Okay, so yeah, it is an ATM. We're also working on a service by which you'll be able to redeem Nook Miles for various things. Please take advantage of these wonderful services. Quite beneficial indeed. Yes, yes. Welcome to Nook Stop, a multimedia terminal from Nook Inc. Once per day, accessing the Nook Stop will award you bonus daily miles. One, okay, 50 bonus miles. Nice, nice. Let's go. Please select from the following services. Nook Shopping, ABD... Uh, I mean, I don't think I have anything in here, but... Loan balance, saving balance. Oh my god, they've got bank accounts now. Good lord, that was the only thing missing from the first game that I was aware of. <laughs> Alright. Please select from the following services. Yeah, yeah, that was the thing, because I remember telling my parents. I was like, this thing shows me how to pay for a house and everything. And then, like, I told them this, like, as I paid for my house or whatever. I didn't even finish the the dialogue because they were like oh that's cool but does it teach you about taxes and I was like no I don't think it does <laughs> and once I go and like after I talked to him I went back and saw that after you paid off your house like he went into how you owed him more money for the taxes and that you didn't actually finish paying him off yet and I was like oh no it does have taxes <laughs> so that's nice, now they've got this in here. Alright, uh, either way though, this is another 40 minutes, so yeah, gonna have to edit this as well. But it looks like we've got a bit of grinding to do anyways, so what I'm gonna do is I'm going to just do a bit of resource gathering and things like that um just kind of chill out for a little bit if anything important starts happening i will uh start recording that so like always if you enjoyed this video be sure to like it up and subscribe if you are not already also if you didn't do it in the last episode or if you started watching from this episode if you have nintendo switch online and you have animal crossing new horizons or just want to play with somebody be sure to drop your friend code down below in the comment section and i might get in touch with you might play some games with you or somebody else in the comments might you never know but that is going to be all for this second episode of animal crossing new horizons i really hope you all are enjoying it literally only played it for like 120 minutes now i think in total um in terms of like in the middle of stream or in the middle of recording and everything but uh very nostalgic um 
I'm still enjoying it. It just kind of sucks that I had to play it in the middle of the night, so obviously it's kind of bland and not much is going on. But, um, yep. I will be sure to see you guys in the next episode.